Well guys, Glorilla's out here trying to trick people into thinking that she's pregnant. So she posted some baby bump photos on her Instagram and her Instagram story and people was like, no, it's fake. This is her Halloween costume. So she responded and said, why would I be wearing a Halloween outfit this early? Be for real. And everybody like, girl, we already know you're not pregnant. So moving on to the next topic, Jada is getting called out by everybody on social media, including her friend Leah. So you guys know that Jada has a podcast called Act Normal with her friend Des Dior. So on this podcast, Jada or Des brought up the simple fact that she was on a birthday trip and two of her friends decided to leave. Now the problem is one of the friends told Jada not to speak about the situation, but she decided to be a little shady on her podcast. And here's what Jada had to say. I had to get ready because we had another event set up for me. Yeah. And then we did the event. So much fun. So much fun. We look so cute. Yeah. And we made a TikTok. We'll insert a TikTok. Yeah. And then the next day, this bitch surprises me with a big ass jet to Paris. My I'm like, friend. she told me the night before, but I'm like, you know, not really thinking Thinkin'. nothing of it. I'm like, okay, like, yeah, I'm down to go to Paris, but is we really going to go? I'm like, how spontaneous are you feeling? How y'all feeling? Literally, she asked everybody, like, how y'all feeling? Two of our friends left. G and Leah, they they left, left. the trip. Um, so tomatoes, tomatoes. Tomatoes, tomatoes, tomatoes. Another different story, different day. Yeah. So, of course, a Jada friend, Leah, has a problem with this because Leah told Jada not to speak on this situation publicly, and Jada did just that. So Leah was on Instagram Live and Jada was in the comment section. You guys go ahead and take a look and I'll be right back. <clears throat> Somebody just make sure that was shape. Oh, no, no, no. Nah. I was mad at Leah for not saying that to me. I found out from Leah. She was leaving too early. Jada, that's a lie. I lit we literally had a conversation that I was leaving. So what you talking about? And even still, like, bro, I'm always there for you. Always, always. E Jada, when you when you got stuck in Jamaica, you got arrested, who was there for you? Where did everyone else go? Home. Who was there? Me. Weeks why I left. So I'm telling them why I left. I'm speaking on my business. I am not speaking on nobody else's business. I'm speaking on my business. So, yeah. Jada, what do you mean what you do for me? You're a friend and I'm a friend. I do that. I would never ever never bring up shit. That's the thing. I said why I fucked away. Okay, you brought up that I left. So I'm telling them why I left. Like you made it a topic. So what what? Like please, please. I can speak on my behalf. I'm speaking on my behalf. I'm not speaking on nobody else. I'm not telling nobody business. I'm not talking down on nobody. I'm speaking on why I left. Yeah, you said different story for a different day. Like, it's not a different... I'm making it a thing. It should have never been a thing. It should never been... I'm not making it a thing. I'm not making it a thing at all. Every time I get on live or every time I'm on on social media, people are asking me why I left because y'all made it a thing. I'm pulling the weird one. No, y'all pulled the weird one when y'all said I left, period. It was nobody's business at all why I left. Stop playing... Yeah, like, stop playing... Bro, stop. 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 Jada, I've been trying to hit your line. I've been trying to meet up with you. It's 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 not even it's not even it's not even <laughs> it's not even nah. Like talking about I'm trying to do a thing. I'm trying to do a thing. I'm trying to do a thing. I never try to do a thing. Ever. I asked if we could have a conversation. I was ignored. But now because I'm speaking on why I left. Now that I'm speaking on why I left, which y'all put on the internet, now I'm trying to do a thing. No, I'm not. I never try to do a thing at all. All I've tried to do is be a friend. Call each other, don't bring it online. It's already online. It's already online, and I'm getting harassed about it. So I'm speaking on why I left. I can speak on why I left. Like, I'm confused. 
Like you, like you just want me to be quiet, but y'all can, y'all can, y'all can get on the internet and say that I left. And then when I'm being harassed and questioned about it, now I have to be quiet. Like, come on, like, let, let's not. Now I got to, you want me to look crazy? No, no, no. And I, and I, and I asked for it. I asked, I asked, and I spoke on how I felt about that being put on a podcast and it was still put on a podcast. It's nobody's business, but mine, why I left. It's my business. At the end of the day, at the end of the day, I always protect my friends. I'm never going to have my friends looking crazy. I don't care, bro. Never, 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 ever. I'm not, I'm not speaking on no shit that got to do with my friends. When people was writing me, asking me, why didn't y'all come? Why didn't they come on my trip? Not speaking on it. Why didn't y'all come to my host? Not speaking on it. Why didn't y'all do it? I'm not speaking on it because it's nobody's business. It's our business. not do jada me and g both left you stopped talking to me but you're still hanging out with g you stopped talking to me it is lame it's lame as fuck i tried to talk to y'all what you mean it's lame it's real fucking lame because i thought we was friends real friends i've been trying to have a conversation like ben ben i i, I tried to have a conversation two weeks ago like what it's lame as fuck, honestly. It's 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 so lame. But it's cool, cause it show me. I'll be doing I'll be too mm -mm. Alright, I'm about to get off here because y'all about to piss me off. So my colleagues out there. Too good, too nice. Yes. Jada, like... A lot of people in the comment section started dragging Jada, and some people even felt like they could see why Ari did not want to be friends with Jada anymore. So one person said, Jada always wants somebody to not speak on the internet. Nah, good. KB, speak up. Jada ain't as innocent as she pretends to be. Someone else said, KB seemed like she holding back. Someone else said, Jada is the victim in every situation, literally. No matter the situation, I have never seen her take accountability for nothing. Somehow, she is always the victim. Then another user chimed in and said, Jada literally threatened to expose her for speaking on something Jada brought up. KB, that's not your friend. And then this user chimed in by saying, Jada and Dez don't want friends, they want flunkies. They went on the podcast and brought up the situation. People was in KB comments asking her about it and she addressed it. Jada got mad like her and Dez didn't bring it up first and that is true. And then the last person said, how is Jada going to say you want me to say what I did, what I do for you? But on the podcast, you was bragging about how she got more money than her friends. So she don't care to pay their tabs when they all go out because she want them to save. Then turn around and say that that's a female for you. Now, that is kind of messed up, especially being a friend. Oh, let me you want me to say what I did for you or what I do for you? Like old girl said, we are friends like you do for me. I do for you. That's how friendship is supposed to work. If your friend doesn't have it, you're supposed to cover it vice versa. Now, throwing it up in her face, that was not right. And like I said, some people understand why Ari no longer wanted to be friends with Jada. But I want to know you guys thoughts and opinions on this down in the comment section below. Make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell. And I will talk to you guys in the next video.